If you want to grow, you have to be willing to step outside of your comfort zone and do the things that are uncomfortable, that force you to face your fears, because at the end of the day, and I truly believe this, on the opposite side of that fear is growth. What I try to do is share some of my background, not just as a fighter pilot, but as a business person, as an entrepreneur, as a commission-only salesperson in consulting and in technology, and apply that to businesses, apply that to the challenges and the protocol and the tactics that individuals need to fly when they're out there with their teams, in a hospital, on a sales call, whatever it is. How comforting it is to know you may be strapped in by yourself, but you're not flying solo. Those wingmen are gonna back you up Check your blind spot for the threats. You need them, and they need you. I want people to connect with me as a person. And as a fighter pilot, they may think that, hey, this guy, he doesn't know what it's like to struggle like me. He's always been a success. He flew F-16s, and it's so far from the truth. My battles with claustrophobia, with fears and obstacles, flying combat missions, that's what really helped me become a better person and truly appreciate how important it was to have a wingman in the air and on the ground to support me, to encourage me, and to eventually be that type of wingman that others could come to for help and that I can support. It's about commitment to excellence, not being average. That's why you're here. Jump. Because the only time that commitment is tested is when the fun stops. My research is like a fighter pilot mission. I plan them, we brief up the mission, I gather relevant intel, understanding the DNA of an organization, the blood and guts, what makes them tick, what are their challenges, what is really going on in the hearts and minds of the people in that audience. So by the time I deliver that solution, it bridges the gap. It's the synapse that says, I get it. He made it about me. He made it about my company. I know what to do when I walk out of these doors and go back to work tomorrow. My question for you this morning, as you ponder your future, opening up a new store in Northern Atlanta, or being in this franchise business with 40 plus stores, Eric, and four kids to support, is what's standing between you and living your dreams as that entrepreneur, as the Top Gun wingman who's in that store trying to grow your business, take a risk, step outside your comfort zone. I put people in the cockpit, have them feel what it's like, the adrenaline, the excitement, the thrill, the fear, and the trust that they have in their team. So when they walk out of that room, they're more present, as to what they need to do to take action in their lives.